we have our science cafe. We're presenting real live scientists um, in our cafeteria working as they would in the field. We are a Project Lead the Way school, and so we focus on science, technology, engineering, and math. But tonight we're going to try to make it a little fun, too. Uh, we've invited students to come and see live science at work and watch the scientists in their chosen field. Kids will be able to um, look at the larvae of mosquitoes. They will also uh, find out about ways to reduce mosquitoes around their um, home or areas. And they can even try a chocolate-covered cricket. Mm. How does it taste? We really hope the students see the relevance of their science classes and their labs that they do, and then uh, for future college and career readiness, they can look at those scientists working here tonight and decide if they want to become a scientist like what we are seeing here tonight. Um, we're interested in, in uh, increasing the number of students that are interested in science. So we um, contacted um, Dr. Decker and we arranged for us to come out here on, Pres on uh, Parents' Day to show them a little bit of what we do at the Florida Medical Entomology Lab. Uh, we're hoping that they get an understanding of you know, the developmental stages of the mosquito, uh, that the mosquito is actually everywhere, and uh, some of the common household items and items of trash that they can find mosquitoes in so that they can do their bit at home and in the environment to uh, clean up some of the mosquito problems. And we're hoping that they actually get an appreciation for, you know, working with mosquitoes and other insects. I think they, most of the kids see science on TV too much and they don't really have an interaction with scientists. So they have a preconceived notion of what a scientist looks like, what a scientist does, you know, day to day. And they think, from my assessment, that it's boring, not exciting, and they can't do anything that they like. So we're trying to show them that science can be fun and every day you're dealing with science. So, you, you know, if you enjoy science, then you can use it for something that you enjoy for the rest of your life. <laughs>